I'm Karen Coons. I'm an associate professor at West Virginia University. I'm also the MPA director of the Master of Public Administration program. I teach in the public administration department. So I teach graduate students, public finance and public budgeting, economic policy, fiscal policy, those types of things. It's probably been about 10 years that I've been using interactive brokers and I really wanted something that my students could paper trade. The students have to take apart a corporation and and then a nonprofit entity and then a state. And actually it's a couple of each. They have to analyze and compare ratio analysis, that type of thing, fundamentals, fundamental analysis. Underlying all of the analysis is economic policy, and so they have to understand how the Fed, the markets, and government spending all work together. So as part of that, a paper trade for the entire semester. The course begins with the introduction to interactive brokers. As part of the very first class session, they begin to understand how they need to interact with the mobile apps, and then The Traders Academy and the webinars take a load off of me. They're learning about it and seeing it at the same time, which is a little different than I can do in the classroom. And it really, it's a huge supplement to my teaching. I have tutorials for them about what a stock is, what an option is, all the different types of investment instruments. Options are tricky to explain, especially to someone who just barely knows what a stock is. And the videos do a fantastic job of explaining that and explaining how to trade them in the platform. So I can use these videos as in-class and actually homework assignments. And they're everything from beginner to intermediate to more sophisticated. So as they understand more what they can do, they dive right in. They go from beginner to old pro in 20 minutes. You can set up quizzes. And that I love because that, that'll make me make sure that the students are on the ball. And so in addition to trading and reading, they've got other types of activities that they have to prep for. But they have to trade weekly. And the goal is to beat the indexes and to beat me. And they get extra credit if they do either or both. So they have to actively trade. They have to actively engage in all of the different instruments from stocks to bonds to options to currencies. And I check their accounts weekly. They can't just invest in Apple and let it go for the semester. The mobile app is fantastic. So they only use the mobile apps and it's usually on their iPad or their phone and nine times out of 10 it's on their phone. They can click on a stock and they can go down and see more information about the company. They can go and see who the competitors are. They can see what industry they're in. They can see performance over time. They can see what researchers have to say or analysts have to say about it. It really is a help for them as they get into the analysis portion. The report management makes it super easy because I give them their performance percentages every week so they can see how they stack up against each other and how they stack up against me and the indices. That's been spectacular. The account management tools are terrific. I can check their accounts. I can look at how their assets are distributed. In addition to investing, they have to be cognizant of uh, diversification. They can't have too much and they can't be too heavy into any particular industry. If they are, then they have to write up why they are. And so I teach fundamentals, but there are some students who want to understand how to use charts. If they want to take it further, they can, and they do. With interactive brokers, you just say, absolutely, here's exactly where you can go to learn all of this. Everything you need is right here. I think it's fantastic. And then I can go play with it when I want to learn a little bit more in my own time. I would say probably 50% of my students leave my class and open up brokerage accounts. They're still in grad school, but they've got the bug. And it's because of this, it's because of interactive brokers. And a large part of them, I can't tell you how many of them have come back to me and said, I have a retirement account in addition to my 401k now that I'm working because I learned how to do this. And a lot of them will go into public service jobs where they've got to negotiate pensions or they've got to write up investment fund guidelines. And it's because of this experience that they can do that. 
I would recommend this absolutely to anybody who's teaching finance. I don't want a different platform. I love this platform. It's easy to use, it's easy to teach, it's easy to understand, the students love it. So I don't want to change anything. I wouldn't be able to teach my class if not for this.